I'm just looking at the uh, tomato plant and uh, this aisle. The four day, uh, four weeks has just passed and they grow very, very tall. Look at this. Can you tell the big difference? When I first time I planted the tomato plant, the, they were this big, maybe. And now this plant is uh, maybe 10 times taller than it used to, used to be and four weeks ago. And if I look carefully, I can see a bud right here. And the, this bud going to be bloomed maybe in a week. So I have to tie them up in this string and all of them. It's going to be hard work, but they grow and they, they are very patient because uh, in the greenhouse, it, it gets to the 40 degree in the daytime, but uh, they grow very, very healthy and uh, I have to respect them. So now I'm, I have to go walk and a lot of walk. So I do my best. I'm just taking the tomatoes at the moment. They have a tomato right here. Look at this, this aisle and the tomato grows very, very tall because it is in summer. And two months ago, I just seeded. Then now they have a tomato right here. So just wondered, how do I water them and fertilize them? The secret is if I look this pot, I grow the tomato plant on this pot. And if I look at the bottom, you can see the clothes. That's close. Uh, suck uh, fertilized water here. This is water. Looks like water, but it's fertilized already. I mean, this is the hydroponic method to grow a tomato, actually. So I don't have to water them and to fertilize them every day because then, uh, they need water. They drink water them by themselves. That is the reason, so I can take care of another uh, lot, lot of tomatoes in this greenhouse. And uh, let's have a look. How do, do I make a uh, fertilizer liquid water? Okay, let's move. And this is the fertilizer I use. I use two fertilizer for hydroponic growing. And uh, both of them, they uh, I put in a I put them into the 100 water to make a basic fertilizer. Actually, it's very, very thick one. And they blend it with a machine to uh, about an, uh, 100, ti 100, ti uh, 100 times to dilute. And let's have a look. Uh, this is a machine and then a control panel. They control the whole greenhouse and water and the fertilizer, this machine. And uh, this is a tank. It has a 200 liter water. And every time the water levels go low, below, there's a sensor on uh, this greenhouse. And uh, they start making a uh, liquid fertilizer in here. This tank. And this is a, a rich fertilizer. Very, very strong one and another one as well and the other tank is uh, it's not a fertilizer tank because this is okay all right this is a liquid i adjusted the paper that says up uh, the, if i put in this paper adjustment liquid the paper goes up of course there's a, a good course goes down but uh, this I use the app fertilizer adjustment to make sure that a proper pay her this water right here, like that. All right, and let's go. And let's have a look. Here, right here. And I just taking a video of the water pump. I use a water, rainwater, and there's a pond outside the greenhouse. I keep it in the rainwater, this pond for the farming. And this is a, 
bombe. How can I say bombe? It's a tank for the oxygen. And uh, my secret is that uh, I'm using oxygen water, which c a l l this with mas- this machine.、Uh, this is called nano bubble. This machine is able to put the oxygen into the water to make sure to grow tomatoes or other vegetables as well, as well to healthy. Let's have a look inside. Here you go. It's a top secret. So I, I, I don't know how to work it, but、uh, they, this machine they can put the oxygen into the water. To the nano level and particle and tomato drinks healthy water every day. Right here. I just get back to、uh, tomato plant right here, taking the tomatoes. And it's summer, it's really hot in the greenhouse. And,、uh, I use a tomato tone, with that means you know, I can pollinate you know, artificially this tomato and the f a c e start growing even though a little bit te- hot temperature. And I also I can use it very cold some w- winter season as well. Now I'm looking at、uh, second floor、uh, flowers, tomatoes, of tomatoes. So I'm just wondering,、uh, I'm going to use a、uh, bee to pollinate them because in,、uh, using a tomato tone to、uh, each flower it takes a lot of time. And if I use a bee, they can walk instead of me. And the、uh, only thing is, a bee does not work in a very hot temperature. So I think it's as the temperature is getting、uh, low, so I'm going to start to use a、uh, B next week. And I'm going to keep filming that, so hope you enjoy it. And bye bye!